testimony from Christiana from Italy. I want to thank God for the recovery of my husband's lost bag, which was lost on the 5th of May 2020, and it was recovered on the 8th of May 2020. The bag contained important documents which we cannot do without, cards for money, for driving, green card, card for health, etc. As I called the prayer line and they prayed and told me that there shall be no loss, it will be recovered, and it was recovered. Hallelujah. I am returning the thanks to God Almighty for answered prayers. Thank you, sir and ma'am, for the wonderful and lovely work you people are doing. God bless you, your family and ministry. In Jesus' name, amen. I am happy. Love you all. We love you too. And we declare, everyone who has lost anything, there shall be no loss. Amen. Whatever the devil took from you is now recovered. Amen. In Jesus' precious name. Amen. Amen. I thought I saw Ame, yeah? Ame P. from Kuje. Good evening, my amiable senior pastor. Sir, something miraculous happened beyond human comprehension. Sir, immediately I received your reply, fully written in capital letters, divine intervention in Jesus' name. My daughter started vomiting out undesirable particles like fish bones, chin chin, greenish substance, etc. After a while, she demanded for food for the first time since she had been complaining of throat pain. So I can't keep such a wonderful testimony to myself. Sir, may God Almighty continue to bless you and your family. Hallelujah. To God be all the praise. Everyone who is having any afflicted child or children around you, the affliction is over. Amen. In Jesus' name. Hallelujah. Amen. Testimony from an undisclosed person says, praise God, sir. I want to appreciate God for what he has done in my life through this commission. I sent in a text concerning abnormal blood pressure that had refused to be normal despite the drugs. And I got a reply, divine intervention in Jesus' name. Since then, my BP has been normal. I give God Almighty all the glory. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Amen. Whatever has put your life under pressure, the pressure is off now Amen. in Jesus' name. Amen. And on, another undisclosed name says, I'm testifying to the goodness of God for healing me from severe sore throats that defiled all manner of treatment. I have been blessed and touched mightily by connecting online to the ministration of Dr. Paul and Dr. Becky. I received a response from them saying, divine intervention. God answered my prayers and saved me and my family from being infected with COVID-19. All glory and praise be to God. Blessings shall abound in Dunamis ministry and in the lives of Pastors Paul and Becky and Enche. Amen. Amen. We receive the blessing. Amen. And we declare the blessing upon you as well. Amen. In Jesus' name. Amen. Testimony, Miss Peace from Zaria. Good morning, sir and ma. I want to return all glory to God for what he has done in my life. The day before yesterday, I was attacked spiritually. Couldn't sleep. I was like a person that was being drained of all the blood in her body. I felt my spirit leaving my body and immediately I texted the senior pastor to pray for me. He replied with just a word, God's intervention in Jesus' name. I shouted, Amen. I prayed with that word before I went to bed and I slept like a baby last night. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Couldn't sleep before then like blood was being drained. Whatever is an arrow of wickedness in your system is retrieved and returned back to Amen. hell in Jesus' precious Amen. name. Another an undisclosed name, good evening, sir and ma. I sent a test concerning financial disfavor and delay that I have been experiencing since this year. You replied divine intervention. I was so happy to get a reply from you. That night I had a dream where a tall, fair man opened a double door for my husband with key in his hand. Since then, it has been a lot, a lot, a lot. And I'm still expecting more. God bless you, sir and ma, for being there for us. God is there for all of us. He had an encounter and they gave them the key and the key opened all the doors. I prophesy to you in this season from tonight. Now, get said somebody under the next 24 hours. Alert, 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 alert. In the name of Jesus Christ, I declare it done. Amen. And we shall hear your testimony. Hallelujah. In Jesus' name. Amen. Another undisclosed name says, good evening, sir and ma. Thank you so much for standing in the gap for the nations. At a time like this, my family has experienced God's awesome healing miracle, and we can't hold it. Precisely 14 days ago, I sent a message about my sister's health condition with symptoms of coughing, chest pain, and lung pains with breathing difficulties, and you replied divine intervention in Jesus' name. I said awesome. amen and sent to her, and she also said amen. I even forgot to include the worst symptoms, which was like a well of saliva that was constantly forcing itself out of her mouth and would not allow her to eat or swallow normally without pains and throwing up. But to the glory of God, while planning to go to the hospital, 
in the morning, divine intervention came as the as the senior pastor declared, by drying up the well of saliva wow. and replace and replaced it in her belly. And a well of living waters. Hallelujah. Around 5 a.m., I rushed to her room thinking her case had turned to, for the worse. As I heard her groaning, behold, she was uncontrollably blasting in tongues. Hey, hey. She said she woke up with no trace of saliva. That when she opened her mouth to pray and thank God, her tongue was seized by the power of the Holy Ghost. And she saw herself blasting in tongues in the manner that we saw. She is healed and completely okay. Hallelujah. Now she can eat well. All glory be to God. What a mighty, 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 mighty Amen. God we serve. Isn't this he's, awesome? He's awesome. Thank you, he's Jesus. He's a miracle-working God, a prayer-answering oh, God. And hallelujah. he will answer you. Hallelujah. And hallelujah. then we have... Mr. P from Abuja, supernatural shifting greetings. So we got married on the 3rd of November 2013. Since then, we have been trusting God for children. I was diagnosed of having low sperm count that failed all medications. We tried all medical assistance that was available to us, including IVF, which failed five times. Five times. Five times. The cost of an IVF at times is around a million there about. Five times. When the last IVF failed, we completely lost hope. But we're still very committed to kingdom service in our location. Leaving everything for God. We came to the nine hour in his presence service at the glory dome during the public holiday last year. My wife's monthly period ended some days before the meeting. Senior pastor in the course of the service declared that the last menstruation she saw was the last. No longer after she became pregnant without knowing. By the grace and mercy of the almighty God, my family is now blessed with a baby boy on the 5th of May. 2020 after seven years Hallelujah. of waiting i sincerely appreciate god for ah. using you mightily in our life in this great commission may the grace and oil of god upon your life continue to increase hallelujah. in jesus name hallelujah. hallelujah who says that god is not alive who says that god is not at work who says that the devil is in control i want to announce to you i don't care what you are passing through and what the situation is the devil is not in control yes, 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 god yes. is god in control, control. In the name of Jesus. Hallelujah. And get ready. Oh, you will be next in line thank you, to Lord. testify thank you, in Lord. Jesus' precious name. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Amen. What a mighty this God. Awesome. Father, we pray for everyone here today. Any testimony you heard tonight that you desire in your life is established for you. Amen. In the name of Jesus. Amen. Somebody with um, a symptom on the head, whether it's a symptom of insanity, I curse it. Amen. Return back to hell. Amen. That affliction, that pain, that headache, that movement returns to hell. Amen. That back condition returns to hell. That Amen. shoulder condition on that left shoulder returns back to Amen. hell. In the name of Jesus, Amen. that COVID symptom returns back to hell. Amen. In the name of Jesus, Amen. the Lord change your story. Hallelujah. Give you a testimony. Thank you, Jesus. In Jesus' precious name. Hallelujah. Pray for one family here. Let God visit them Amen. with the fruit of the world oh, oh, and visit their, another family with amen. a child problem, amen. child like epileptic or something. We, we stand on the authority of the word of God and by reason of this testimony we just received right now, we just heard right now, and we break the yoke of barrenness in your family in the name of Jesus. Amen. Every satanic affliction, failed IVFs, failed procedures, failed um, interventions, every blood fallopian tube, every uterine synecate, every frozen pelvis, every low sperm count, every hormonal imbalance, every hyperprolactinemia, every 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 cervical incompetence that has been responsible for your fruitlessness today it is arrested in the name of jesus amen. we declare go forth and have your babies in jesus name amen the last menstrual cycle you saw is the last forever you take it and you carry safely to them and you deliver safely in the name of jesus amen. and for that family with that child suffering that satanic mental affliction and that child suffering that convulsion and that child with that autism in the name of jesus we declare urgent immediate divine intervention in the name of jesus amen that child is healed and every arrow every plan and plot of the enemy against children against anybody's child today that arrow is arrested retrieved and we fire it back to sender in the name of jesus amen Your children are free amen in jesus name so shall it be amen in jesus precious name Hallelujah.